Welcome back to uh, Ranger Life, I guess. <laughs> I did pick up a new engine. It's under this plastic wrap here uh, from, you know, Junker. I paid, uh, I think, $350 for it, which is a lot cheaper than the cost of a rebuild. Uh, supposedly, it has 43,000 miles on it. It's out of a 2.5 Ford Fusion. So basically, the idea is that this engine and the 2.5 Fusion engine uh, they share the same block, pretty much, and so most of the accessory, um, you know, thingies that go on there, and the belts and stuff, or the pulleys and stuff, are sort of in the same place, supposedly. I believe the heads are a little bit different, but I'm assuming I can just adapt a lot of the stuff. So yeah, I should be able to reuse a lot of the, the stuff on the 2.3 on this engine, or just use the parts already on this engine outright. So let me stop talking about it and go ahead and try to get that tranny off today is the big thing and maybe even lift the engine out. So here we are. Um, I was gonna film more of the disassembly but uh, there's a lot of cursing involved and many hours of just cursing and... <laughs> but uh, <clears throat> I got the transmission out as you can see there, it's kind of at a weird angle, so I probably need to ratchet that down. Uh, I need to get it out from under the truck too, but I need to raise the truck in order to do that. But I'm going to lift the engine out first. As you can see, the engine mounts, um, the bolts or the nuts are loosened and off. I need to remove this fuel rail, Let's get it out of the way. So hopefully the engine doesn't catch on anything here and just sort of carefully lift this out. Uh, it should be free. So, run into a slight problem. Um, this is as high as the, the cherry picker goes. <laughs> so, I mean, the engine's out but it's just not being able to clear the front here. Hmm, I mean, I could lower the truck somehow. I don't think I have much of a choice here. I think I'm gonna need to lower this back down, uh, set it back on the uh, engine mounts, and then lengthen this guy out, and hopefully that's long enough to, uh, <clears throat> you know, get high enough to get the engine out. back on its engine mount. It actually wasn't too bad um, getting it in. That was good practice. Got that done. Oh man, my battery's gonna die. But basically I'm gonna clean up here because uh, it's getting dark. And then next week I'll turn to it and see uh, what I can swap over here. But yeah, that's it for this week. Woo. That was hard. But yeah, got it. All right, thanks for watching.